I think it's filming. Is it filming yet? Right, so we've got Clive's uh, new build. That sounds sporty. Oh, beautiful, mate. Is that, what is that, 1100 or something? 1275. 1275, yeah. And I, I must say, man, that the, 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 the paint job you've done, not necessarily the paint job, because I know you've worked on it in here and a lot of dust particles, but the the the, the, the c c colors that you've chose, yeah. the, 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 the colors, I just think is freaking fabulous. I'm going to do the inside of the and the dashboard. Uh -huh. Is it going to have any naughty stripes or any numbers on it? No. Just, just simple, classic, just classic style. Yeah. Um, I love this, man. I love it. This is like Cornish cream, isn't it? What did yeah. you call it? Uh, Cornish ice cream. Cornish ice cream, that's it. And he's fitted, did you say a Mark 1 boot? Mark 1, yeah. And he's also changed the, the panels to fit these Mark 1 lights. Yeah. yeah, I don't know much about my minis. So he's made a, a classic rear end. Smells lovely in here now you've started it got some nice classic looking seats a mountain steering wheel to go on and you're going to put a three a three three clock dash, three clock dash. hello dude and a, mark one grill. and a what mark one grill. where's the grill got it you haven't got it yet it's going to be a mark one morris cooper grill that sounds awesome oh, i love what you've done with this clive how long have you been working with this car <laughs> You say about six months? Yeah. Full time, yeah? That's all you do, isn't it? You you, you throw yourself into yeah. the project. What, what what condition was it in when you got it? Bare shell. No front end, nothing. No no front end? No. Right. What parts have you fabricated from this car? Well, I have, you know, show board panels. I've put new seals on, new wings to the front panel. Yeah. Uh, Did it need a lot of welding? Not a great deal, no. Right, the, okay. The board was good. The original valance was still on the back. Uh, not too bad. The inner seals were good. And is it, this has got a, a lot. Has it got its logbook with it? Yeah, yeah. Oh, dude. And you're thinking about because you're already thinking about your next project. Yeah. Which is going to be an American V8 powered. Thirty-two roads to pick up. Right. Because the one we came. Some of you might have seen the video that I filmed with you a few months ago, mm. but uh, you decided you didn't want the video up, so we deleted it. So. That's changed now. You did this instead, mm. but you've still got the engine down there in bits, and yeah. you showed me the pattern yeah. of the 32 ro Roadster. Yeah, 32 right. roads to pick up. Pick up. Right, gentlemen. If Clive doesn't want this video removed, the one I'm publishing here, we might get an update in a few months, yeah. isn't it? Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Because it's nice to keep a, a log of, of, of the thing and to see some of the things that you make yeah. from scratch. Anyway, I love the colour on this, man. You said midnight blue or something. Island blue. Island yeah. blue. I love it, man. And did you rebuild the engine or was that yeah, good? Yeah, it's all new. You rebuilt that yeah. as well? The engine, I was near about 1,500 quid. Why, has it got any space? Has it got any got cams? Blue pistons. It? It's got an Evolution 2 cam in it. Uh, I have got a big valve head to go on. It's a Cooper SA, 11 stud. Uh, I'll put it on when it's, when it's running. I guess you've also got to put um, a limit to how much you're going to undertake in one go, isn't it? Yeah. Because you get overwhelmed, don't yeah. you? Right. So, chaps, that's Clive's most recent creation. When do you think it's going to be uh, complete and on the road? Probably a couple of months, something like that. A couple of months more? Yeah. Come on, man, it's nearly ready. It's all little bits now. Yeah, bits. the little I've bits. I've got to put the roof lining in and everything. The devil's in the details. Yeah. Oh mate, what a nice little motor I've got mate. a complete interior to go in to match the seats. Uh-huh. Yeah. And has it got a bit of a sporty exhaust on it? it yeah, sounded... it's got an RC40. RC40? Yeah. Is that from the engine all the way to the back? It's got a, a free flow manifold yeah. and then the, the, the RC40 at the back, the back box. Yeah, it sounds nice and throaty yeah. this does, mate. Whoop, whoop. It's got right. Cooper S brakes on it as well. And it's got Cooper S brakes. Yeah. And you said it's got something, the wheels reverse something, were they? Reverse rim Cooper S. Reverse rim Cooper S. And uh, it's got adjustable suspension all around as well. Oh. I'm running two degrees negative on the front and one and a half degrees on the back. Oh, how could you do that at the back? 
and the good uh, uh, brackets you can alter the. Oh, what is it fixed like? Yeah, yeah fixed. Yeah. So is this so it can turn a little, It'll a little better? As well. Oh <laughs> mate, that's beautiful, man. Right, okie dokie, well I'll leave it here and uh, thanks for showing us this beautiful little mini mate. Okay. Um, so I look forward to seeing this again and some of our subscribers will want to see what you finish with, yeah, what yeah. you end up with and also if you don't mind the beginning of the 32 that you're going to mm -hmm. do, alright? Yeah. Right, Storm? Here's Storm isn't it? Yeah. I had to ask, because I called you this morning and I had to ask my mum what was the name of Clive's dog? <laughs> And he, she remembered. Right, mate. He likes playing football. Come on then, do it. <laughs> right, Clive, say goodbye to our followers, man. See ya. See you later, guys. Thanks.